Hi, this is Jamie with Coastal Business Supplies. Today, we are going to go over setting up your new Sawgrass SG400 sublimation system. First, we are going to start off with unboxing your new SG400 sublimation printer. When ordering with Coastal Business Supplies, you will receive a sample pack of sublimation blanks, 100 sheets of sublimation 8.5 by 14 paper, an installation kit which has your ink, your SG400 sublimation printer, your power cord, and a USB cord. Next, we're going to go over what is included in your installation kit. First up is your quick installation guide. This is a basic overview of installation of your new printer. Next up is your USB drive. This will include your manual as well as additional information on your SG400 printer. You will also receive four ink cartridges, cyan, magenta, yellow, and a black ink cartridge. Next, we're going to plug in our printer. You're not going to turn it on yet, just plug it in. Take your power cord and plug into the printer itself first, and then into your wall outlet. You will also see a waste ink container. Eventually, over time, this will need to be replaced. Next, we're going to install our ink. You have received four ink cartridges, cyan, magenta, yellow, and a black. At this time, you're going to install them into your printer and shut the cover. Going over your paper trays, you'll first see your bottom tray, which is tray one. That is where you will install your paper. Above that is your output tray where the finished product will print to. When installing your paper, you will notice that 8.5 by 14 doesn't fit very well in the tray itself. You will need to adjust for that size. First, you move the bars to the side, and then you see the two little green tabs on each side, the right and the left. You will move those out and then push the tray further back. When looking at the paper, you will notice a bright white side and a dull side. When installing, you will put the bright white side face down. Move the tabs in and push the tray in, and then let's get ready for the next step. We are now going to work on downloading your Virtual Print Manager software. First, go to sawgrassinc.com, select Products, Software, and Virtual Print Manager. From there, scroll down and click on Download Virtual Print Manager. You will see a login box next, either logging with your email or you're going to have to register if you are a first time user. Registering is very easy. You will just need to fill out a few different boxes and then click register at the end. From there, you will go to a login page where you can now register with your email address and your password. Next is downloading the actual software. You will see two different options, a Windows option and a Mac option. Click on the option that best fits your system. And from there, you will start a direct download to your system. Once the Virtual Support Manager has completed its download, you will see a setup box. Follow the prompts on the setup box and reboot at the end. Once your system has rebooted, you will double click on the Virtual Support Manager box. This is a green box found on your desktop. Click agree to the license agreement that pops up on the screen. Right now it's going to load data onto your system. When the download is complete, you will see a set up new printer box. Select from the drop down. In this case, we are going to select the SG400 printer and then click install. You will have to sign a license agreement again and then click next. Click on add a new printer and then click next. And then click connect via USB cable and then click next. At this time, make sure the printer is still off as well as the USB cord is not plugged into your system and then click next. We are going to wait for the copy of the files to complete. And once this is complete, we're going to move on to the next step. Now you're ready to turn on the printer, as well as plug in your cord to the printer and then your USB to your computer. We are almost finished setting up your new SG400 sublimation system. The next step is to register your printer. To register, you will need your serial number, which can be found on the back of your printer.
Once you have completed the registration steps as shown in this video, we will now move forward to complete the printer installation. After clicking OK to the Thank you for registering prompt box, you will see an input tray settings box pop up. Make sure that tray 1 is selected and then click OK. At this point, you should have your installation complete and select finish. We're done. We're now going to move on to Creative Studio. Creative Studio is an online program through SawgrassInc.com. So go to SawgrassInc.com, select Creative Studio, and then select Access Creative Studio. Here you should see a login box. Log in with your email and your password. Then select Launch Creative Studio. When entering Creative Studio, you're going to first see Product Wizard. You're also going to see Product Category. Here we're going to select Blank Design Canvas. There are several different options that you can go through to fit your needs. Now we're going to select Next. Here you will see Select Product. This is your page size. Today we are going to work with 8.5 by 14 as is sent with your printer. So we're going to find the 8.5 by 14 and then select Next. Select Product Color, which would be white. Select Next and then your page size. We're going to select Vertical. We are going to work with a pre-designed image. So we're going to go to our image folder and select our design. You're going to go up and select Print name your canvas, include product building line, and then click here to print. Now your virtual support manager box will pull up. There are several different tabs in your virtual support manager box that will pop up. Today we're going to choose Unisub products for our substrate. For paper, we're going to choose text print R. We're going to print on high quality speed. We're going to mirror and we're going to print auto tray select. You can either choose that or tray one. You can go through layout, jobs, and then color is your next tab. Color is the most important tab. We here use graphic and color sure on most of our prints. Color sure is what's going to correct your colors. So if you do notice a change in your colors, make sure that it does not say disabled. And here we go, here's our print. You're now finished with setting up your Sawgrass SG400 sublimation system. If you do have questions, please do not hesitate to call our technical support department. We can be reached at 1-800-562-7760.